Actress Jennifer Garner was in Cambridge today, not for a movie shoot, but to accept an award that Harvard theater types have given out for the last 70 years. Kisses from men in drag are standard fare when the nation's oldest theater group parades through Harvard Square in your honor. But with windshields in the single digits, Jennifer Garner might have joined this chorus line just to stay warm. Tonight, the celebration went inside for the traditional roast, where the honoree is required to embarrass themselves in multiple ways, like giving a description of that first boyfriend kiss. He tried to um, go further than a kiss. <laughs> I swatted it away, and then he broke up with me the next day because he said I was a prude, which I've, oh. a badge I've worn proudly ever since. As the hasty pudding woman of the year, the 49-year-old actress joins people like Viola Davis and Meryl Streep, folks deemed to have made lasting contributions to the world of entertainment. Not just for her TV role in Alias or movies like Juno and 13 Going on 30, but also for her efforts on behalf of Save the Children and the food company Once Upon a Farm that she co-founded to feed needy kids. Garner took today's nonsense in stride. People said, you should maybe watch old YouTube videos, and I decided, you know what, I'm going to go in blind. And I'm so glad I did, although nothing could have dampened my overall joy and enthusiasm for the day. It has been an absolute blast. It's the kind of tribute that the veteran actress will remember, and so will the students who grabbed a selfie with her. Oh my god, it was fantastic. I've grown up watching Jen Garner, and I just love seeing her on screen. and She's so sweet in person. Garner will turn 50 in April and says she's actually looking forward to it. Actor Jason Bateman, who just happened to play Garner's husband in the 2007 film Juno, was honored earlier this week as the Hasty Pudding Man of the Year.